Oh no. Hey, hey everyone, and welcome back to Nix and Mix. It is Mix, and above me is Nick. Nick. You haven't seen Nick from this angle ever. I don't have face cam, so. Yeah, yeah, we figured something out. It's really sketchy. Probably <laughs> it might break. We'll find out. Yeah, uh, but Nick has never seen Reddit, and there are some certain Reddit pages that I suspect that Nick would really like. So we're going to begin with one page, and we'll just look at it for like I don't know, twenty minutes. Um, so on Reddit, there are things called subreddits, which is where people gather with similar interests. I think that's a fair way to say that. Um, so the one that I really want to show you is one called just rolled into the shop i figured you would like this so without further ado here is the first one i have saved and then we'll probably just scroll through a bunch when you run he's out of regular paper towel. towels <laughs> he's got the blue scott's shop towels <laughs> the classic <laughs> it's classic <laughs> well they absorbent really nice flaunt your wealth yeah people are just talking about it but okay Oh, <laughs> no! that's like wiping your butt with $20 bills. I don't think they're that expensive, but I guess some places they are. All right, next. Ka-chow. <laughs> ka <-chow. laughs> you, know, you know, like Stance Nation? This axle's completely broken half from that. <laughs> it's so good. Let's see what the people are saying. Oh, that's going to be expensive. I don't get this. You're going to have to explain this to me. Dana44 failed the jump test. I mean, it's a solid axle. What do you want? It ain't an Ultra 4 car. It ain't built to jump. There's no bracing over that. Of course it's going to break. Front sploot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm not even mad. At least it's being used off-road and not crawling across the Macy's parking lot. Yeah, I mean, he tested the limit. He found it. He found it. <laughs> don't you hate it when customers leave their pets in the car? A box of chickens. <laughs> <laughs> Just a casual box of chickens. I, I've heard some weird stories of stuff people have found in customer cars. Like, oh, wait, they bring them in for service. Time. And there's just some weird stuff. Like, people have no shame and even trying to hide anything. They just leave it just on the dash. Mm hmm. This is the real honesty test of 2023. <laughs> Yo, those too <laughs> much chickens, homie. Ah, uh, yes, there's the wheel lock key. It's the Glock in the glove box. <laughs> <laughs> but it's okay. Hey, they got some good. tissues to clean up afterward. Yeah. And the and the uh, the black ice oh, air yeah, freshener. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's a all the stuff you need to hide a crime. You clean it up. You clean the sin. <laughs> yeah. I love when this happens because I get to shoot the locks off. <laughs> I think you meant wheel Glock. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone likes a good smelling gun. Hey, he's, he's seen the black ice air freshener. <laughs> yeah, high torque, single use impact. <laughs> oh, this one's not very funny, but it's uh, it reminded me of you. Might be me. But look, look what they have. Look, it's right here. What, my big green toolbox? Yeah, your massive green toolbox. Mine's bigger than that, though. I think it is. <laughs> yeah, because mine's got, see how it's got the bays on the one side? Over here? Yeah, mine's got the bays on the other side, and I have the top chest. Oh my gosh. All right, one of the employees told me he couldn't get all the tires to 100%. How is he alive? Is what I want to know. <laughs> Dude, That's he just almost got that. Asking for it. <laughs> this would get you an A, though. Wash your problem. 93, 94, 96, isn't the the average somewhere as like 95 ish? You know, like that's that's totally yeah. gonna get you an A in any course. Oh yeah. He's of course, you want 100, but. <laughs> Yeah, that's the problem, child. Here, there's the problem. Not that he's just trying to get sent to Mars, courtesy Elon, get wrecked. But, you <laughs> get know. wrecked. That's a G-rated version. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Your workshop doesn't have a bomb defusal robot by chance. Yeah, I would. Nah, I ain't even gonna try to bleed the pressure off that. That's a. Oh, just tell him to go drive at 90 miles an hour for a bit and those pressures will rise to 100. <laughs> <laughs> Get the tires warm. Just found bucks. this on the front seat. I take really good care of my vehicle. I'm kindly asking if you would please take special care when you're removing the tires or working under the hood to please avoid scratching the wheels or clear coat. 
I corrected the paint and everything is coated and I am overly cautious and I hope you will be too. Then don't drive your car. Please, no car wash. As a token of my appreciation, there is $10 next to the shifting console and I appreciate it if you bought yourself some lunch today. But, uh, okay, thank you so much for understanding. 10 bucks. I used to kind of a cool customer. I know some shops just don't care. They make these mats that you're supposed to throw over the fenders mm. that keeps you from scratching them, but some shops, I guess, don't have them or care to use them. So Baja Billy and his dinner plate belt <laughs> buckle leaning over the fenders <laughs> <laughs> going to town on that. For me, this really depends on what they're driving, right? Like if it's an old beater and they're leaving this in there, like seriously. Yeah, no. Some um, people are pretty sentimental to old cars. Though. That's true. That's true. Okay. This guy really loves their car. Let's see if the comments have any explanations. Oh, this car. This is a car with more sentimental than monetary value. It's always nice to see people love whatever they drive. Look at you. Did you leave this comment? Are you W1987G? Sub G string. Oh, my wife oh. put 15 gallons of diesel in the gas tank. I present to you a money, fa money fountain. <laughs> <laughs> 15 gallons of diesel that is I, okay so this, this is economy? something that always fascinates me i don't know how people are this dumb to do this because the 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 little nozzle thingies that you fill up your tank with they're two different sizes the diesel one does not fit in the gas thing how did she do this then? Did she put it in the she can? She just held it there and oh. just kept filling it because they don't fit in. You can't autofill with them. Huh. I didn't know that because I've never tried. <laughs> yeah, next time you go to the gas station, just grab the diesel one to look at it and it's huge. They're way bigger. I'll look down the barrel of it. See if it's yeah, bent. Yeah, see if it's bent. I guarantee you it's bent. <laughs> <laughs> Look at you. See, <laughs> this is it. your subreddit, uh, man. Fit. Leave it alone. Here, the diesel pump have a wider nozzle to prevent this. I asked her, and if the pump was yellow, and she said, "Yeah." Is diesel okay. also yellow? I thought it was green. It depends on location, okay. because if you you're at a pump that has E85, the E85 pump's going to be yellow. And, but uh, most diesel pumps, at least at our location, are green. So. Huh. Run that through a filter, just sticking in a tractor. <laughs> Diesel's pretty forgiving. But I don't understand like why you needed to stuff a screwdriver <laughs> into that. Maybe it has like a, uh, it probably has like a rollover check valve in it that he had to keep open. But Did a manual a... swap on a client's DCT Focus, and he wanted to keep the automatic trims to weird out the passengers. I'm working on modding the auto shift knob right now. Yeah, any thoughts on that? It says home mechanic. That's his flair. <laughs> He's a self-proclaimed okay, home I'm... mechanic. I, I've seen this before people do this. It's interesting. You can still tell it's a manual, like, unless you just don't know what you're looking at. But. Well, this is an automatic to a manual. Yeah, he's using the same position for the shifter. He's leaving, see the little the indicator on the side? He's leaving that to try and make people think it's an automatic oh. still. But. I, I don't get it. All right, next. Oh, oh. <laughs> um, I'm not sure that one can. All right, has anyone ever seen this? Oh, great! We love things for distracted driving. I love tools that make distracted driving better. On a BMW? I don't know. What is this center? The center console looks real bougie. Let's see. I don't know. There's that's a huge like guesswork. That leads to distracted driving. Puts every function imaginable behind four layers of UI on the touch screen. Is it a Ford? It's a Ford Transit Courier van. Hmm. Oh, I wonder if they do that for GPS. Yeah. Like the GPS units, I exactly. bet. Exactly. To be honest, I've been watching like delivery driver videos like FedEx, UPS, Amazon. They always need power because they're doing these routes for hours a day. Mm -hmm. I doubt that this is giving wireless charging. No, you probably have to run a cord from the box up to it for your 12 yeah. volt supply and they don't like that because if you have to plug and replug all the time every time you get in and out of a van it's mm -hmm. it's not convenient so Badness. one of my customers rents out his vintage mustangs this is how one was returned to him uh, yeah don't if you got a car like that and somebody wants to borrow it and they're like a really close friend 
don't. <laughs> and even Man, then, you like, you're be like, there, bro. You know? <laughs> yeah. Like, bro, you afford this thing? <laughs> ah, yes. <laughs> I've never seen a car that failed a home inspection before. <laughs> what is happening here, Nick? Is this like Underglow City or what? I don't know what he's doing, but he has a four outlet wired into his Oops, car I'm, with the uh, plugs. <laughs> with the plug. At least he had the courtesy to use wire loom. Yeah, this is good. Uh, I've seen people use wire nuts on car electrical before, but I've never, I haven't seen this personally. What the heck is even happening? All right, let's read the post. Let's see. We have to get some answers. Isn't that one of the damn electric automobiles everyone's <laughs> talking about? Tesla Model F. <laughs> 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 the wires all disappear never to be seen again except one that goes to the oil pan looks like oh, a is that redneck what said? this is the original poster he's ASE certified I don't even know what that means but he says it looks automotive. looks like a redneck install engine block heater system That's what, I was wondering if it's some sort of winterizing uh, deal for like a block heater what? dominoes <laughs> hey these loaded thoughts are too tight Please laugh. Oh, I had a stroke reading that. <laughs> I had a stroke riding it. Said the guy. Riding it. <laughs> Writing. Ding dong. Uh -oh. The worst decal I've ever installed. Yeah, there's far more torque than this Honda can make. I doubt that. <laughs> I highly doubt that. Unless you're running some sort of race vehicle. Nah. I laughed. Oh, I laughed she's smoking. <laughs> I laughed when the write up was engine sounds like a video game. And then I started it. Does it have audio? Yeah, but you can't hear it with the way we're doing this. It sounds like popcorn a little bit. <laughs> and then a lot of electrical sounds. Um, yeah, she's good. <laughs> just run it. I think it's fine. I mean, at that point, you need a new motor anyway, probably. Just keep like someone stole a caliper off a thirty-eight thousand dollar. RAV4? Is this a new RAV4? I guess. It looks like every other SUV on the road. They stole the cow. They left the Harbor Freight Jack. <laughs> Bruh! Nice. Free Jack, son. <laughs> but they took the <laughs> <a> handle. <laughs> yeah, you can make a handle. That's true. You just need something. Just put it there. Pipe. Yeah, that's the Harbor Freight Racing <laughs> Series Jack. Oh, he beat the crap out of that rocket <laughs> Man it's, was in a hurry. It, Customer asking for price sent us tire measurements. Okay, uh, I don't know yes, much. Okay. I don't know much. Not how that works. But I do know that they have the size on them, or mm -hmm. you can just tell them what vehicle or wheel you're running. And if these are stock, which I believe there is a logo for, um, like, is that Hyundai? It's too small. Uh, hang, hang on, hang on, hang, hang, oh, hang no, on. Oh no, he gone. Well, these are stock wheels too so if you just tell them what you got uh they don't need your oh <laughs> someone has found the curb more than once curb rack <laughs> maybe he wants a wheel maybe that's what he's trying to do is get a wheel but still it says the size on it just yeah the car up and you can get the wheel size i don't know what's happening there customer states headlight not working <laughs> They put the I wonder why. fluid in. That's good. Yeah. yeah. But uh, <laughs> That's a really common problem. But you know, the customer said he changed oil mm. eight thousand kilometers ago, which in American units is like uh, you know sixty four hundred. I'm kidding. That's wrong. I don't know. Ew. Where did you <laughs> see that? Really one? looking up your damn self on Google. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> That's uh, 8,000 kilometers, which is approximately looking up your damn cell phone. <laughs> yeah, no, nah, oil don't do that in 4,000 no. miles, but... Man, the sound it makes when it hits the bucket or the floor, you'll have to hear it later. 10,000 miles original tires. People with DeLoreans do that. They're so cool. They, you know, you just keep them. Don't do anything with them. Don't touch them. I know people that absolutely hate them cars. Like, they despise them. Why? I think I think that they're just so novel. In a cool way. It's not like novel like the 2016 or whatever Ford GT where they made, I don't even know how many, but it wasn't many. And they're like, oh, it's the best thing we've ever done. And I'm like, eh, it's ugly. Yeah, I think it's all the hype that was built up about them from the movies that oh. because they were 
they were designed poorly. They're built out of not great material. I mean, they're stainless. They're heavier than the Titanic, <laughs> and they're got nothing for an engine. I think even in the movie, I can't remember if they pushed it or they pulled it with another car because it literally would not do 88 mile an hour. <laughs> it oh, it doesn't. Bad. I've been inside of one. Insert photo here. And the top speed, if I remember, the speedo only went to 80. <laughs> so Yeah, they, they do not do 88. 88 miles an hour! So well, I don't even... What if it didn't even get that fast? Like, you just use wide-angle lenses, low camera angles, and it looks like it's going 88, but they were just going, like, 40 in a parking lot. It, it could have. Very well oh, could have. It could be like the train where it was a model. <laughs> that's right, it was. Oh! Stretch Daddy? Stance Nation, bro. <laughs> what is this? Stretch tires. Oh. oh yeah, that's what happens when you ride on the rim. Oh. Rest of the tire is good, but you wore down that end. Stop falling asleep. God dang you. Oh, it flipped. How'd it flip? What is happening? Hang on. <laughs> I'm wigging out here. Okay, we're good. Can you even see how much he's shaking? <laughs> that's uh most more than likely that's gonna be an electric assist steering wheel. The servos start going out in them and then they wig out. I don't work on customer cars. Well, that, kind of. Not It's factory. a different kind of customer. <laughs> it's a different kind of customer, yeah. That is our first video of looking at Reddit. We'll be back. I want to show Nick Idiots in Cars, one of my favorites. I uh, okay, love okay, that one. Okay. And then we might do FU in particular, but there's going to oh. be a lot of censoring that needs to happen for that one. So I, I'm, I'm down for it, though. I'm legit. I'm just going to make this a thing we do here. I'm not going to go on here personally. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, thanks for joining me. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It will be back oh, yeah. next oh, yeah. time. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this has been Nix and Mix. If you enjoyed, please press that subscribe button.